Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking in. Thank you for your likes, overwhelming comments, positive, negative. They are always welcome. Apart from the insults, who always say this, but they always come insulting. I don't understand. Guys, this is a place where we all analyze, we criticize together, we agree, we disagree, and we move on. We just move with the vibes. We only analyze or criticize some of the videos that have been put out here. What's the big deal? Anyway... Thank you so much, my team, for coming back to check on me, to support me. Your love is just so amazing. You people, you are just everything. Like keyboard reactors, you are the best of the best. Super slappers, my moderators, uh, premier gang members, you are the best of the best. And I always tell you what, guys, I love you to the moon and back. Have you checked my store? Kindly do check my store and pick anything that you feel is good for you just to support this channel am carol we have stuff for men ladies accessories and for kids everything is in there in my store just to support this uh channel am carol can we move yes let's move first of all let me take this opportunity to congratulate miss trudy for reaching 400,000 subscribers congratulations 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 anyway it's like a normal day for her. She's not the kind of a person who will come out and now start sitting down and doing live videos, insulting <laughs> and laughing at those who are still behind. She's not that type of a person. We all know she has her class and respect that. Definitely, right? Yeah. So, first of all, if you remember what Mara said yesterday, he said that, all these YouTubers, they've gone there because I am the commando who opened the way for them to come there. <laughs> so now they came there because they've noticed that, oh, in Jamaica, it's a good number and it has views and blah, blah, blah. You know, Maro will never tell you the truth. He will never tell you anything about the CPM in Jamaica. He will never tell you that. Let me tell you, that's what it is in the Caribbean as a whole, because most people are in the diaspora. So... Yeah, the channel is growing. Definitely, when you go there, even African Tigress on her community post, she said, guys, thank you so much. You know, I've gotten more subscribers than ever. So it is happening for everyone who is at the Caribbean, especially for this, our big YouTubers, our big African YouTubers who are there. Anyway, congratulations to Miss Trudy. And thank you so much for holding on. You know, people thought that maybe she will retaliate or maybe come for this girl but i think she's not of her level of her class of her <laughs> coming to that someone wrote somewhere i don't know where i read this i don't know somewhere that you are saying that you are not of my class or of my level and we were all born on earth and stuff yeah class and level in people's lives it's different it's how you carry out yourself the energy that you usually throw out there Usually when you throw out positive, you will always be receiving positivity. When you throw out negativity, you will be always receiving negativity. It's not about... I read somewhere, someone writing that uh, this thing of class and yeah, you know, when they come insulting and telling me all these things, I have to remind them here. Yeah, I have to come back with my video and remind them that, listen, class, it's all about your attitude towards people. I know we, we are all born, you know, from our mother's womb. We did not come from heaven. We never came from somewhere else. But when you come out here and you start presenting yourself like something else, it will always come back to you. It is what it is. Can we move on? Definitely we know this is how our girl does. And she is copying all these things from Marwa. You saw the other day when Marwa came with a live. Every time he needs to address someone, Instead of addressing the person because he has the contacts, he has their contacts, he knows how he can reach out to them. But what will he do? He comes on his life and start addressing that person on his life. Live video. Live stream video, <laughs> for that matter. And this is exactly what Dimango did. She was just waiting to reach 400. I see 400 or something that was so hard for Trudy to reach. Trudy was almost there anyway. And she's behaving as if Trudy has only two or three subscribers now. She is the one who is on top. 
she's coming out to say bad things about Trudy and laughing all the way. It was so, so annoying looking at her. And now see, Miss Trudy is already there as if it was something that is, it was so hard for her. Come on, please, Dimwango. You know, you need to change your ways. You need to shape up. You need to learn how to address things and address yourself as well. Now, this is Dimwango with her friends. We were talking about how you always release positive energy, positive videos that attract your net worth. We were talking about these things. And Dimwango people, they're always insulting me in the comment section. I don't understand you people. You see, we say things, we bring up the receipts, but you just refused to understand. You refuse to get it in your skull. Who are Dimwango's friends? Are these the kind of friends who will come back and invite her for something that, you know, like, let's say, let me just give you the example of this Asafa Powell uh, video that uh, Miss Trudy did. Have you seen how many views that Miss Trudy has only on that video? It should be taking more of around four videos from Dimwango that can reach to only this one video from Miss Trudy. <laughs> one video like this is carrying four of Dimwango's views. Four times, four times of Dimwango's views. Because of the thing that she's releasing out there. And the question remains, is your network your net worth? Mm -hmm. You come for me. Come take me to police. Come and kill me. <laughs> this is my opinion. I say it the way it is. See, these are Dimwango's friends that she wants to mingle with. While in Jamaica, she is showing us, oh, these are the Jamaicans that are in Jamaica. See, this, this is the people that she really, really, really want to mingle with that can bring her the network. What I miss about Jamaica is how, you know, I interact with the locals. The interaction between me and the locals. I love it. I love it. I love it. It's always a good moment. Until you travel, that's when you'll fancy such things because sometimes you're in countries where people have no time for you. Everybody's busy, but Jamaica is never a dull moment. People have stories, people can sing, people can, you just name it. It's never a dull moment. Anyway, guys, welcome to Sav Lama. It's my first day here, and uh, yeah, this is what I do. You know, I'm a full time traveler taking you across the globe checking out different places so let me know have you ever been to Sav Lama or D Mwango is showing you your own country <laughs> most of those who live in UK because my number one audience is from US UK you know that is England holy parts Americans live there and me appreciate so much where's the market I don't know you from Guatemala Uganda <laughs> Africa. I'm from? You're South Africa, Uganda. South Africa, Uganda. Yes, I know that place in the Middle West. I know Middle West, South Africa. Uh huh. Yes, this is Uganda. <laughs> what do you know about Uganda? I know that the Middle East is far out and they make so, some bomb. Bomb they make. They make bomb. Uh huh. Yes, they make boom at day time in wow. West Africa. Mm hmm. In Middle East, West Africa. Middle East, West Africa. That's right, that's right. What is your good name, Mr. My father? name is Jerry Mike O'Neill, Coke Thomas. Hey, you have such a nice name. Yeah. What are the neighboring countries of Uganda? Oh, you have Barbados and Trinidad and Tobago. Wow, those are the neighboring countries of Uganda. That's true. Wow, you're the most genius man I've yeah, ever met. Harry man. Wow, wow, yeah. wow, wow, wow. You're the genius man I've ever yes. met. Yes. Barbados end? Yeah, ma, ma, ma. Barbados end? Yes. You said Barbados end? Yes, ma, and uh, West Africa. Aha, uh -huh. Barbados Africa. and West Africa, those are the near, you know, the neighboring countries of Uganda. And West Africa, ma, ma. <laughs> Far in the, in the West Africa, Middle East. Middle East. 
Yes, man. Wow, wow, yes, wow. I understand. Wow, nice to meet you, my friend. I'm, I'm okay. You've eaten? No, I haven't eaten from morning. You haven't eaten from no, morning? No, I haven't eaten. Why? I haven't eaten from morning. Why? I have no home. I'm, I'm, I'm homeless. You're homeless? I only have a treaty carrot. Treaty carrot? Yes, I only have a treaty did what? I found some phone on the street, but okay. no one responds. No one responds. No, no one responds. Okay, because you're telling me you haven't eaten the whole day and you just met yes, me Yes, I just eaten mine. Okay. In Let's West learn. Africa, the Middle East. I just saw my friend somewhere. Let me let me call him and see if I can get... Because he just locked the car. Let me see if I can call him. I go pick something. Then we go eat together, okay? Yeah, man. <laughs> Yes, guys, your network is your net worth, right? <laughs> your network is your net worth. I like moving around because I'm the only person who is traveling to show you the locals of um, Jamaica. Hey, Jamaica's in the house. So, kindly help me understand. So, this is how your locals are. In Jamaica, no, like kindly help me to understand because this is what our girl is showcasing us. I mean, showcasing, showing Jamaicans. This is local Jamaicans, according to what she said. She feels so good. It's a different feeling because Jamaicans are good and Jamaicans are the best of the best. And I enjoy, you know, interacting with them. And then, yeah. She picks out one of the Jamaican locals, and here he is. Oh, West Africa, Uganda. Oh, <laughs> guys, please, please, come on. Let me understand if this is how the locals in Jamaica behave or locals. Me, I don't want to say what those things that you want me to say. I won't say them. I will say it the way Dimongo said. We use their words. She says these are the locals, right? She like showing us the locals in Jamaica. And these are the locals in Jamaica. <laughs> locals in Jamaica, you don't eat food. <laughs> locals in Jamaica, you sit on the streets waiting for foreigners to give you some food. Locals in Jamaica. <laughs> locals in Jamaica. This is how you behave, locals in Jamaica. Locals in Jamaica, you don't know where South Africa and Uganda is. Locals in Jamaica, you don't know the neighboring countries of Uganda. <laughs> or you know, or if you know, you know. <laughs> Barbados and Trinidad are the neighboring countries in Uganda. <laughs> Locals in Jamaica, Ugandans, they make the best bam bam. <laughs> please, please. The question here is that, is your network your net worth? It's too simple. When I come here saying things, you say, ah, see, you like comparing this, you like comparing this other one. Ha, locals in Jamaica, are you ready to welcome Dimwango again and host her? Yeah, and make her feel good, locals in Jamaica. It is what it is, guys. And for that reason, I applaud Miss Trudy for getting to 400,000 subscribers. Congratulations, congratulations. And also, it is congratulations to Dimongo because Dimongo is learning to understand the locals in Jamaica. She's learning to understand everything that she's doing on the streets. She's like, you know, sometimes you need to understand her because of where she came from. Maybe this is how she views people or this is how... Oh my goodness, guys, what am I talking about? What am I talking about? Let's go back to Nyabuhansi. Let's go back to Nyabuhansi. The stuff in Jamaica is tough. In Nyabuhansi, Marwa is going around looking for maize, going to buy cows, going to buy some chickens, going to buy some plants. Marwa is torn into pieces that cannot... Be even collected together. Mara is all over the place. 
Mara is no longer thinking about to furnish his house anymore. Mara is not thinking about, oh my goodness, whatever Mara is thinking about, only God knows. So he woke up, he's going around. Oh guys, I'm running to the border because I need to go and buy maize. Maize, sacks of maize, dry maize, the maize that we usually make ugali from, you know. We grind it into the flour and then we make ugali with. That's the maize I'm talking about. He's going at the border of Tanzania and Kenya to buy the sacks of maize. Marwa, who is going to consume all those maize? I don't know what is Marwa is all about. Marwa is running again with a boda boda. Marwa, where are you going? I'm going to look for a cow. <laughs> that chicken, you know, the other one has gone to, I mean, the other one is laying eggs or the other one is laying on the eggs and now that cockerel, it needs another chicken. We need to buy another chicken. Marwa is running. Maro, where are you going? I'm going to buy chicken. Maro again is running all the way on the road. Maro, where are you? I'm going to Migori. I'm going to Migori to buy the plants because we need to plant the plants. Maro is a busy guy. Maro is everywhere. Maro is, hey! Maro has forgotten all the things that he started. He will never finish. Maro is waking up every day with different ideas in his head every single day different ideas if that idea doesn't come to pass he leaves it there and goes to the next one like that Mara is all over the place i don't understand Mara. maybe if you understand Mara, let me know how do you understand Mara? Mara reacted on someone that uh, i didn't feel good about i thought i should bring this issue here on the table Someone sent some gasoline, petrol, for his generator because he says now he has a generator that is using petrol. The other one was using a uh, diesel or something. So someone has sent Ken Gore to bring 20 liters, 40 liters actually, of gasoline for the generators at Maro's place. So Maro is like, what, what does this guy or the person want from me? Because, you know, for me, when you bring me something, what do you expect from me as well? Oh, definitely it is views and subscribers. So is it working? These are Kenyans living in Sweden. Kenyans living in Sweden, they have sent gasoline to Marwa. But all they want is for Marwa to give them shout outs, send su subscribers to subscribe on their channels, <laughs> guys i don't know why people are too desperate to this extent if you listen to that story very well it's a very sad story the two kenyans the lady and the son they were supposed to come at marwa's party they never came because the mother got an accident and also the son got the accident so they are sick they are in hospital beds and the pictures that they sent to give to Maro so that Maro can feel sorry for them and send people to go and subscribe to them. And after Maro was seeing all those things, Maro was pissed off. <laughs> Maro was pissed off. Maro was brushing the story like, okay, guys, go, 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 go and support these people. Just go and support these people. And Maro is gone. And gasoline is left there. Just like that. You know, people think like when they come to Maro, crying and showing Mara all their problems. Mara will, will feel so sorry for them and support them according to what they expect. But we have been talking about these things here. We have been saying these things. People don't listen. People are arguing and insulting instead of listening. See what is now happening. We came here crying for strong man. Strong man, strong man. See now what has happened with strong man. How will he be coming back again to recharge his have uh, views hmm? you see now these ones they didn't see the other lady that came from nairobi and marwa and the engineer sent her away just like that she was busy explaining to the whole world all her problems what was her name jane who she explained and the people felt sorry for her but by the end of the day she was never helped. Mara cannot help you. The only thing Mara can do is to only receive. 
and that is it. See, this is Marwa and this boy explaining all these things. And by the end, what did Marwa do? Today, and before I start this video, I want to thank a very special uh, person here. First, hey, Ken Gore, introduce yes. yourself. Hello, guys. This is I am underscore Ken Gore. Yes. Travel what? Commando number two. Why are you here? Can go. Okay, I'm here. I, I was sent to you by one of your subscribers. Okay. Yeah. What did they bring? Can go. They brought uh, 40, 40 liters of uh, petrol. Why is not full? Can it's full. Hey, open with it. So, so uh -huh. they, uh, they are family from Sweden. Okay. But they are Kenyans. Okay. So it's a mom uh -huh. and a son. What's What's their name? Uh, I have their channel here. Okay, come with your channel. Guys, can go uh, brought you some gasoline. As you know, guys, is my generator has been running on for months. I hope I'll be able to to get, uh, you know, I'll be able to get a better option, which is solar panels, which I'm working on. Yeah. So. They are Kenyans, but they live in Sweden. They live in Sweden. Actually, they were planning to come for the party, uh -huh. but they got accident and the son was airlifted. Hey. Yeah, the wow. mom, yeah, the mom lost the teeth. They wow. even sent me a picture here. Wow, like that's you, so sad. Even right now, yeah. they are struggling to pay the, the, the dental problem. Wow. Over 1.4 M. Oh my God. Yeah, so that's so, what has been happening. So let's see, they are, so, so they, want, they want you they want my people to go so, and, and subscribe uh, to their so channel or what's going on. Yeah, the main reason why they have started the channel, yeah. because you know, when you are outside, yeah. outside there, yeah. you can't work, yet you are uh, you are, uh, you are sick. Oh. So they want, uh, uh, they started a channel yes. just to... Gitriba, bring me the, my jacket so we can go. <laughs> or we go tomorrow, you decide. What time is it? The time right now is five. Yeah, five what? Five zero zero. Ah, that's okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. So they, they started a YouTube channel. Okay. Just just to bring some uh, to bring uh, little income to maintain them because they can't work. So, but but you know YouTube is not as easy. Have they bought like master class? Yeah, they have bought the master class. Okay. Both the son and the mom. Okay. Yeah. All right. Let's. let's so see. here is uh, Auntie and daughter. At Auntie and daughter. Auntie and daughter. Wow. Uh huh. And uh, the the son is Karani Steve. Okay. Yeah. I think I've given them a shout out before. Yeah, you've given them a shout out before. So Karani Steve says he's at 128. At 128 and the mom is at 50, 50 subscribers. So which which one should we support <laughs> first? I, uh, I think you should just support them both because the son and the mom, yeah. they both got an accident. Oh. The son is, is not even walking. Oh. Yeah, I have... I have let me show oh, you. That's sad. Let sad me show you the yeah, sad news. Let me show you the. Wow. But did they, did they say we can show? Yeah. Okay. This is uh, Mama Steve. But then why are they sending us uh, petrol if they are in a? Whoa, whoa, whoa. You see, this is uh, guys. This is Aunt Indota. Uh, I can't show that. It's it's very terrible. And uh, this is the sun is. The sun is a bit okay, but More the sun broke away. the legs. Oh my. So God. this is the sun. Okay, that's but, that, that's the sister I mean. Yeah, but the mom now you saw the situation. Okay. We can't we can't show it. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, that's what happened. Oh yeah. That was a car accident. That was a car accident. Personal car. Personal car. Wow. Uh, Steve Steve got an accident when he wa he wanted to come. Uh -huh. The mom was in Kenya. Uh -huh. So the mom was waiting for Steve to come uh -huh. so that they ca they can come for the party. Uh -huh. But when uh, when uh, Steve was on the way. He got the accident. Here in Kenya? No, Sweden. Sweden. The mom got the accident here in Kenya while he was waiting for Steve. And Steve got another accident? When he was in Sweden, when he wanted to come and meet him. Ah, to come for this, the this story is sometimes when people tell me, how I keep wondering what's going on. Yeah. Anyway, guys, please go support this family one more time. Aunt Induta and... Let me show you Aunt Induta. Yes. And uh, this is Aunt Induta. Okay. And Tindota and and the son Karani Karani Steve Karani Steve yeah all right guys yeah please go support them and uh, let's get Karani Steve one thousand subscribers and the mom now even I feel sad for them sending me the petrol because these are sick people who need help yeah but not not helping others yeah, the, the 
Uh, I asked them, the yeah. main reason why maybe. You know the mom, they are struggling with the, with the hospital bill. Okay. Actually in Sweden, the mom said everything, the, the hospital bill is free. Actually I'm feeling so sorry for these people who are buying master classes from Marwa. This is now the second case that we hear. Oh, these people have bought master classes, they are going through this, but they are really struggling with their YouTube channels. Why are they struggling when they have the master class? They have the master class, they bought it already. What is next? I thought that master class will take them to all those subscribers and hey, I don't understand. Last time there was an issue about someone who was so busy and serious about this master class thing. You know what happened in Yabohansi? Guys, you know what happened. She's no more. Now, I'm starting to think differently. Right now, I'm thinking differently. Why is this masterclass so dangerous now? Hey, guys, I don't know what you think. Kindly let me know what you think. And even after listening to all that story, the only thing Mara could say is, guys, go and subscribe and give them the 1,000 subscribers. And Mara is busy calling Gitriba so that they can move out and go. He's busy. He is busy. And the gasoline, he has received it anyway. Will these people really get the 1,000 subscribers? The way Marwa said it to his own people. And remember now his own people are now tired of being told, subscribe here, subscribe there, subscribe here, subscribe there. Is that going to happen? <laughs> Me, the things that happen in Yabohanze are just different for me. Sometimes it's not easy to understand all these things happening, honestly. Why was Marwa bragging about the bridge? Why was Marwa bragging about the bridge? Marwa made this bridge, this small bridge. <laughs> and he feels like, oh, he made the bridge for the community. Oh, this bridge is helping even drunkards. Drunkards that are passing over there now, they can't fall in the river. Oh, Marwa did something so big. Rocio, mom, Rocio, mom, come out and see Marwa. Marwa is the hero in the village. He has really made this bridge, and now everyone is happy Marwa has made this bridge. Hey, guys, welcome to Gichoro Choro. Here in Africa, we are just cruising. You might be wondering where we are going to. Through Gichoro Choro. Look at this. YouTube bridge in Africa. The most dangerous bridge. Yeah, like today it's in been Africa. raining. Look, look, if you're not careful, you click here. Like Buguru. You cannot be drunk here. And imagine drunk people pass here. Oh. Drunk people pass here, imagine. I put this. Actually, I'm the one who made everything here. Everything you see here is because I've given somebody money to make. And sometimes, People can steal these trees to go and use them as as firewood. Now Rocio is an expert. I think right now the Jamaican grandma can easily pass. The other time he, she really struggled. But the, the last time he was he was like ah. Yeah 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 yeah. yeah. But we didn't have this, you know? Even though look at this. Look He's at this shaking. Time. But it's better than. But it's better than before. A hundred percent. Because we are heading to our forest, which is right there. We are going there. Right there. <laughs> I like. Hey guys, I like the way Rocio is supporting Maro in everything. Oh my goodness, guys, we are coming back to reveal this Rocio girl. I don't know what this girl is up to. Like really. Instead of just telling Marwa the truth, like, listen, my guy, this thing is too weak. This thing can kill someone. This thing, let's do a better thing than this one. Can we do something better? Can... Rosie is like, oh, yeah, 100%. Oh, look at this one is shaking. But it's better than before. Yeah, 100%. And I'm like, no, Rosie. <laughs> oh, my goodness. What have you eaten? What have you eaten? Is this something that now a millionaire should be bragging of in the community that he has made this for the community? Yeah? They kept on going, uh, walking with Rocio, and then it happened that uh, Mara went to 
bring some not like bring he met a few kids and he was asking those kids to come and greet the mzungu so in the whole village everyone knows oh this is a rasta guy with a mzungu so it's a profile on its own the rasta guy with the mzungu now he comes calling these kids come come and get the mzungu come and get the mzungu and these kids they don't want to they don't want to come and greet the mzungu do you know what mara told them mara told them you are not lucky i think you should come and greet this mzungu for you to be lucky and you know i'm thinking i'm looking at mara and i'm like what kind of initiation is this what are these people doing to the kids why why is it a must and if not it's not luck for them so what kind of luck are these people talking about are they going around initiating these kids into something that we don't know guys and you all understand this thing of Rusio and Marwa bringing kids on on their videos I am <laughs> I told him to come and say hello come he's, a, he's, he's shy we don't know who you That is his brother. There are two. Like this now is full. As this is life in Africa, and a small boy like this is taking care of these big cows. Huh? So did me have a mzungu who come here? That's why I had to go out. And I have. Yes, say hello to him. Mzungu, did me? Ona mo agapa. Ona agapa mzungu. She's afraid of he's afraid of you. I'm sorry me are you toy work amra. Ah akujo mshike mkono. We told him to come and, and catch you and touch you there. Yeah. He greet you like kama hivi angalia. Shikamo. Kuja amra. He is afraid. If there were two he could. Yeah. But he's alone. You know village boys here they only they only take care of the cows and You lost your opportunity. Uma potaza bahati mra. Kujum msalimie. Marwa said umepoteza bahati. You've lost your luck. Rosio said you have lost an opportunity. An opportunity to do what exactly? By not greeting her you have lost an opportunity. An opportunity to do what exactly? Umepoteza bahati. You've lost your luck. Your luck on what exactly? <laughs> Guys, I don't understand. No. Me there are things on these streets that are usually beyond me sometimes. You know, I just want you people to also make me understand. Maybe you people you understand more than I do because I don't want to start overthinking. This overthinking is killing me. <laughs> I don't want to. Today I don't want to start overthinking. Like honestly, what is this thing they're talking about? What does it mean? Don't come here and tell me all oh, the there were jokes because they were not. This is content. What is this content about? What are they talking about here? Let me know in the comment section. Leave your comments down there. Let me know. Like this video, subscribe also. If you haven't subscribed, click on the notification bell so that every time I upload a new video, you'll be among the first people to be notified. And also check my store and pick anything that is good for you. We have stuff for men, stuff for women, accessories for the kids and pets and everything. Pick anything that you love just to support this channel AM Carol. And what can I say more guys? Let's meet on the next one.